gonna ignore about the puckering of this top it just does that and I can't fix it because my boobs are not the size for this top not to pucker also look at my new rings they're so pretty all right um anyway so today we're doing a three-part reaction we're doing a reaction to cl spicy i do know she just had a comeback i'm aware but i need to react to the songs before the recent comeback so i know what's happening and then we're reacting to brave girls it is written in korean so probably be helpful to see the video to know the title and then i am goddamn so without further ado let's get right into this video excuse me I need, more I need to record more. I need to record a reaction to Umbrella Academy. I should do that I mean, today. This is strain of consciousness. <gasps> this man. Energy. He gives me um like auto-generated right like Energy. what is it? Text to speech. That's what he gives me. But I think the song is kind of gonna be fire based off of this intro. I just really like the beat. I feel like the chorus is either going to make or break the song. I have two ways in my brain that it's going right now. I love this outfit though, the black, um, the black of his hands. I think it's just the set. I feel like they could do so much more with the background dancers in that set, but they aren't utilizing it to its full potential. It might just be the framing, honestly, like the way that the camera's panning through them. They could have a more dynamic pan. I do love the skirt outfit though. And then the ones with the slits with the leather the leather slits. Leather slits, oh my gosh. The diamond slits on the side of her like leather pants as well. I feel like that's also a fashion statement. I'm still unsure about like that hoodie moment that she had early on. I felt like that was kind of meh. It exists, it it's okay, but it's not giving me as much fashion as the other two. So I kinda wish that the other two leaned more into well I wish that one leaned more into the aesthetic of the other outfits because all three outfits except that one where she's in the trench coat I felt like those were very much more cohesive um and I get like you can do things that aren't cohesive but I, I just originally didn't like that one as much and I felt like that scene also wasn't used enough to justify that outfit to um the extent that it was shown um but yeah it's a okay song I'm not a big rap fan i do appreciate the way they went with the chorus i think it makes sense it's more leaning towards jesse's sound of music in my opinion um 
but it's missing that kind of extra energy. I think this is like a chill song versus um, some of her other songs. Um, like I will say like one of her debut songs like Hello Bitches and things like that, which had more punch and more energy, which I think as a listener, I am pulling out my charger because I always forget this part. Um, but I just felt that it could have been more. I'm talking so long about this song. Let's just get into the next one. And this one is called... Well, Lightning Age. This one is called After We Ride by Break Girls. I do like the lighting. Ooh, green top. Cute, cute. Give me fashion. Okay, she leans against the car. I guess. I guess. Oh, she's so pretty. <laughs> That iPhone is not that durable, no offense. The iPhone is not that durable. this song i think i like it more than spicy it again i think lyrically but also um sonically i was gonna say the music of the video overall something i would more so lean to and listen to um i also really enjoyed like the lyrics because i think they spoke a lot about like maybe drinking habits if you're someone who uses alcohol for comfort and things like that so i really liked how they were able to take um i think things that not are that are not always really spoken about and actually like bring it into the song so i really appreciate that and i think that overall it's a really nice song i s mentally think i like it more than shit than shit baram i think that was the last one 
that I listen to by them and I think I like it more but I also don't remember what that song sounds like that much um, so it might just be like a spur of the moment feeling so let's get into the third and final video which is ooh, oh you want to start already wow um I am goddamn God damn it, I like it. Oh my gosh, I pretty good. Yeah. Can't be shaking. Yeah. DMs. I don't need a name. I forgot that. Give me shot to over everything. God damn it, I like it. This is so Americanized. Kiss me down till I make it. This is so Americanized. I just need a need a need a need a need Give me shot to over everything. God damn it, I like it. God damn it, I like it. Part of me, I can't be better than that thought Why you trying to ruin me? I'm fine with just me I like this song yeah, I, I think it's literally because of the depth of his voice That makes me like it already But I actually like the song I think I think it's literally because of the depth of his voice That makes me like it already But I actually like the song I think it's literally because of the depth of his voice Again, it gives me lyrical depth. I like the lyrical depth, but it's just again the melody of this. I I can see myself driving, like, and like playing this song, but probably not when I'm in the car with my mom. But she'll be like, "What are you doing? Are you doing?" It's more like it just me in the car, just vibing. It's definitely vibe song. I really like this one. See, it looks more like blood here than it did in the first shot. The first shot just looks like a pomegranate. I don't know why. This video feels like it took a lot of time to actually like shoot and plan, which I really appreciate. You can tell that the cinematography of this was as important as the lyrics and what he's trying to portray. This is his first solo mini album. Interesting, interesting. I like it. I think of all three songs, this is my favorite. Probably I would say I would rank them in the reverse order that we just watched them. I just feel like overall that song I liked again lyrically but I also really enjoyed sonically and I can like see a time where I'd be listening to it and I can visualize myself playing this a lot versus like the first one which I don't really see myself playing as much um, and then the second one which I feel like I like but I don't know if I like it to the extent of me kind of making it one of my favorites because for example i think the songs the k-pop song that's currently been on replay for me is an hyphen drunk days and hyphen drunken drunk days i play that literally like so many times that it's on a lot of my um, spotify blends so um again it just needs it needs something that's either super energetic for me or super vibey but if you like this video don't forget to like comment share and subscribe you guys are gonna probably all have this view for a bit of me it's a little weird to shoot because like i feel like i have like double chin moments on here um please don't screen cap those
probably already did. Um, but yeah, I will see you all in the next one. Bye! Direction, I miss you, think I'm drunk, pour more.